Women's professional soccer scoring big with fans across the country, especially here in Los Angeles. Our very own team, Angel City, is now the focus of a new docuseries. Eyewitness News reporter Christian Cordero talked to some of the people behind the team's success. LA's newest professional sports team got a Hollywood welcome like no other. Angel City is a three-part docuseries following the club through its inaugural season. Angel City, spread your wings! Trust is a pillar for any successful team, especially when the team involves a film crew. I credit that to them and the organization for building up the trust. And I think it helps having Natalie headed up because you know that, you know, it's coming from a good place. By Natalie, head coach Freya Coom, of course, refers to co-founder Natalie Portman, who also helped bring the docuseries to life, as did director Arlene Nelson. Her vision was to mix thoughtful, sit-down interviews with a more organic, verite style of storytelling. And I think it makes for a really dynamic show. The more verite that you can bring into a show, the more you can engage people and kind of sweep them along as the narrative is unfolding. Plenty unfolded. But they're able to kind of take us behind the scenes. Yeah, there's so much that goes into a match day for us that, you know, we're back of house and we don't see. Like, we don't see how the fans are reacting. We don't see the performances that were that took place that day. Every match day, Angel City brings SoCal soccer community, LA's production experience, and Hollywood powerhouses into a 22,000-seat stadium. The club sold out its inaugural match and has since averaged an attendance of more than 19,000 fans. Team captain Allie Riley grew up in L.A. She turned pro 12 years ago. This is the first time she has had a hometown team to play for. When you're told so many times that no one wants to watch women's sports, no one cares about women's soccer, you start believing it somewhere deep down. So that first night when we sold out last season, I was bawling my eyes out. The highs and lows continue this season with a script unfinished and an audience that cameras on or off wants to show. We want to match their dedication and support with the results that we do. So this year, I think we've started off well. We've incredible players on the team.